Okay, so I sit here and try to make a video, and I attempt to make it a few times, and I watch it back, and I'm like, ew, I don't like how I look, or I don't like what I'm talking about, or I notice that I'm holding my mouth some weird way, and I'm not being myself, and it's like I try so hard to make these videos so perfect that the time I, when I just hit record now, I was like, okay, I'm just going to talk, and I'm not going to edit things out. I'm just going to talk and upload this, because I think that that's part of my um, frustration behind making a video and that is that I'm always concerned about what I'm gonna say who I'm going to offend when I'm what like if I'm going to be honest about what I did wrong um, if I forget to talk about something you know so many things are going through my head when I press that record button and then my videos come across as being very flat and being not the true me coming out in my videos and that's the last thing I want because I'm always true to myself and why can't I be that way in my videos? So this is me. This is the real me. I'm not going to edit any of this. I'm not going to press record again and start all over again. This is how it's going to be. And uh, that's how I have to do my videos from now on because it gets to be, and I know some people might be able to relate to me, but it gets to be a lot when you're like, oh, I got to record a video and then, you know, the lighting's not right or the um, topics aren't really PC or whatever it may be. So... Anyways, today is day what, I don't know, <laughs> eight, nine, uh, eight on the junk food rehab. Yesterday I did not make a video. Um, I did think about it a little bit throughout the day, um, but overall it kind of just, you know, I didn't really, I just didn't make a video. <laughs> Let's just leave it at that. I didn't make a video yesterday. Um, yesterday was a good day. I had the day off because it was Thanksgiving. We did all our family stuff over the weekend, as I said in my last video. So yesterday was a really nice day for me and my husband to just sit around, and I did go out and visit a friend, but for the most part, sorry, I have a cold, um, just sit around and, <coughs> um, apologize, uh, sit in our pajamas and watch Sons of Anarchy, which is a show that I am so in love with. Um, so it was a great day. Now, I, we did snack quite a bit. Um, we did eat a very unhealthy meal last night. Um, I don't know what it is. It's like I keep getting drawn to these delicious foods. And I am a really good baker and a really good cook. And I I love doing those things. I also enjoy trying to find healthier options for those special um, meals or desserts that I make. I really do. Um, but sometimes you just can't. Like last night we had ribs and um, a potato casserole that I make that has like bacon and cheese in it. So that's like far from healthy. Way far from healthy. But I tried to balance it out, you know, and, and use a little, um, a little more healthier options within the recipes but some things it just doesn't work with and some things it just you know how can you make healthier bacon and cheese potatoes use less butter yes use low sodium bacon maybe or turkey bacon yes but I'm really not a fan of turkey bacon I guess these are the sacrifices that I need to make to lose weight and I understand that but I refuse to be that person that changes so much in my life that it's not enjoyable to me. And by that I mean um, using almond milk in my coffee. You know, I've heard of that one. Not for me. No, not for me. I will use Kramer milk. That's that's how it's going to be. Um, little changes like switching out my milk for almond milk in my cereal, I'll do that because I really can't taste the difference when it comes to certain cereals. But I refuse to be that person that changes so much in my life that everything I'm doing revolves around losing weight and and changing things that I enjoy 100%. I don't know if there's other people out there that feel like that. And I, I don't want to come across as thinking or people thinking that I think I'm going to be... I'm going to get the results that I want to get without changing because I know that I need to change to get the results that I want to get. But there comes a time when you're like, how much do I have to give up and how much do I have to change to, to be that person that I want to be? Why is the person that I am now not good enough? 
I kind of am regretting now saying that I wasn't going to edit this because I'm doing a lot of rambling, but that's how it's got to be, I guess. Do you ever get really frustrated with constantly hearing people talk about, you know, those, those, those people in your life, whether they're on the weight loss community on Facebook or YouTube or whatever it may be, but all they talk about is weight loss. All they all they talk about is I did yoga this morning and then I had a egg white scramble for breakfast and then I went for a 15 minute walk and then at lunchtime it's like is there not more to your life and I know that your life needs to be healthy as a whole and things do need to revolve around your health obviously without your health there is no life but is that all that you are you know what I mean? I don't want to get lost in it again. That's happened to me. I've been I've been lost in it where nothing else was important except for what I was eating and how often how often I was going to the gym. I did feel good, but there's got to be a healthy balance, you know? Life's way too short to be constantly stressing and worrying about what you're putting in your mouth and where you're moving and how you're moving. For me, it's I need to find that healthy balance because I'm either all or nothing, and that's the type of person that I am. The second that I I start doing things right, it's like I'm all in, but then the second that I I slip, I'm all out, and I really need to find that happy medium for me because I'm either here or there. I'm never in the middle, and the middle is where I think I will find true, ha true health and true happiness. Um... But all my life, I haven't been able to find that middle ground. It's either I'm completely obsessed with nutrition and fitness, or I'm completely the other end of the spectrum and completely unhealthy and eating crap and not caring for my health and well-being. And neither of those are healthy. Neither ends are healthy. So I really need to focus on, on that, on being a little bit of both. And I've tried in the past, and I'm trying now, but it's not easy whatsoever. So anyways, so this is what happens when I am just sitting down, hit record, and just talk. You get a 7 minute and 40 second message. I mean, video. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to cut this short now. Cut this short. <laughs> I'm going to cut it off now. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to make a video tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.